Mm -hmm. We have a whole bunch of them. Morning. Good morning, guys. It is May 1st, the opener in Colorado, <laughs> the western slope of Wyoming, and uh, Nevada. Nevada. <laughs> and we're in Nevada. So we're going to go see how honest uh, some people were. And uh, hopefully, hopefully we don't prove that a shed closure only keeps the honest honest, even yeah. though we're 100%. Which is what we suspected. Uh-huh. There's already, I already see four-wheeler tracks uh, taken off right here from where we're parked. So it'll probably be a big letdown because Nevada has I'm their holding out head hope, in man. Ass. I'm holding out hope. So here we go, opener. We are getting ready to head off and uh, hopefully pile up some sheds. So, yes, here we go. Well, Nevada opener. And we're getting snowed on. What the hell, Nevada? Now what are you gonna do? It's snowing. Better close it for a couple more weeks so these elk don't die in these deer. Hopefully it doesn't last something. Let me get my rain jacket out. All right, guys. We're well, technically we're on the board because I found that little chalky spiker, but uh, we're on the board with an actual antler, branched antler now. And uh, looks like whoever poached this area didn't come down in this canyon enough and missed this one because this is last year's home. But there's definitely signs of people all through this country, which sucks, but we'll keep pushing. They can't find them all. Ooh. And I'm gonna slide and fall down. There we go. There it is. Oh, there's the other side, I'll bet, right there. Look at that tank. It's a good horn. Heck yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna have to get that thing out of there. Pause for a second. Little baby. Two little babies. As cute as those are, not really what we want to see. More of them. Okay, there's the first horn, and this isn't a match. There's no way. It's the same side. <laughs> um, didn't even pay attention to that. So there's the first horn. And then... There's the second horn. Pretty good horn too. Big old bass on him. Long beam. Cool, cool horn. Heck yeah, good, good weighing horn too. Big old long beam on him. He's got good length. Heavy bull. Heavy, heavy bull. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Setting up a little shelter for a minute. As you can see, it is snowing. But that doesn't really stop us. I'm just hungry, so we're gonna eat real quick and then head back after it. Seems like uh, people were in here before they were supposed to be. <laughs> oh. You missed the goldfish. Ready? What's up guys? Hey. It's uh, about 1.30. We decided yeah, to take right. a little break. It started snowing pretty hard. Mm -hmm. And so we decided to take a little break and Britt's having a little snack. I'm eating a little bit of some goldfishes with Rue. Huh, Rue? <laughs> She's catching them. And uh, just got a little campfire going, kind of drying out a little bit. Hmm. And Rue is eating goldfish. And one for me. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Rue? Do you want them? <laughs> mm -hmm. She sounded like she said, mm -hmm. Yeah. You having a go go squeeze there, babe? Yes, I am. What flavor? Apple and banana. Oh, nothing like putting crap in one, something that's good. It's very good. 
I would like a it's apple my favorite one. and poop go-go squeeze. Are you even knowing where you're videoing? Yeah, I'm looking right at the go-go squeeze. <laughs> you're like videoing. I'd be go-go squeezing that right into the fire. Rock wall. <laughs> Stupid banana. Did you get your uh, goldfish? You're ruining my pants. Why do you think you need to be in my lap? You're not a lap dog. Yeah. Be a wolf. Oh, it's snowing again. It's snowing. Still those two. That big one. That's it. Bro, how about you find? <laughs> Look at this. You're so needy. Mm -hmm. You want me to carry you around the mountain? Wow. Yes, she does. Huh? <laughs> Can I have a kiss? Oh, thank you. I appreciate your kisses. Your relationship. <laughs> All right, so yeah, we're just chilling. We're shed hunting poached country. Good job, Nevada. Yep. Way to take Way care to of the go. honest citizens, uh, the honest people, and and your citizens that uh, follow okay. the rules. You you lock them out and you let all the uh, dishonest people in. Good job. Nice law. Winning. Makes a lot of sense. You don't like it either, huh? No, it might go so sad. Huh. What a spoiled dog. She wanted to find a shed too. We're not done though. We're just going to keep going deeper and farther. Until we get away from the folks. Build a snowman. You don't like that idea. <laughs> You're hitting the spot. <laughs> That's funny. Mm. I didn't know I had that much more. There's proof that Cheetos. Show me Cheetos are flammable. Cheetos are flammable. You can use them to start a fire. You can use them to start a fire. I found a deer shed. You do? Yeah. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> I, we, just needed, we just needed to turn our head a little bit. Cool buck. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then his little match is right there. For elk sheds and I'm finding deer sheds. <laughs> These are a lot easier to pack though. It's a good deer horn. Heck good, yeah. Good Got a nice eye guard. See this is my specialty right here. <laughs> Straight typicals. The other one. Cool buck. Cool, cool buck. Pick Sweet, man. He's up high. Yeah, he is. So does that mean the elk are like... On top? <laughs> yeah, we need to go up. We're too low. In uh, 20,000? Yeah, 20,000 feet. Yeah. Let's see him. Good buck, babe. Nice. Or bigger deer. Well, I have that elk shed found. Or even bigger deer. Yeah, she's got one down here we think glassed up. We're gonna pretty we're, 99% sure. We're moving around this hill to try to get a better angle on it and uh, go from there. Dang, I'm glad I found something. <laughs> Alright, what's up guys? So I glassed up a shed. I'm up on top right there. And I'm just not getting down to it. And it's what I thought it was, a little ragger. I could just see that tine sticking up. That, that those back two tines, I should say. And it's old, an old chalky ragger. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But, nah. Oh, there's another one right there. Another old chalksta, chalkmeister, the chalkiest of them. Match, matched him up. <laughs> Just kidding. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Well, Britt's coming down over two fingers. We're gonna meet 
and uh, head up to the top of this. And there's a couple more patches of trees we're gonna go hit and kind of work our way back. It's getting late in the afternoon. Josh just walked right by that one. He was just a little bit lower than me. I took the right path. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're in a whiteout. Lots of fat snow falling. So we made us another little fort because it's uh, snowing pretty heavy now. And uh, <laughs> Remy comes running up to us with a horn. Good job, Rue! We're still shed hunting. Does good job. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> you found one. Yemi yeah, found a shed. Good job, Rue. That's all by yourself, too. Yeah. Come here. Come here. I give you love. Come here. Come here. Oh, good girl. Yes. Yes, that is a good girl. You got snow everywhere. Britt just found one, too. Why, uh... She's been uh, getting stuff for the ceiling of our fort. <coughs> I don't have it. <coughs> Emmy. She doesn't get why you're not um, going to ball, Dad. I know. I don't have a ball room. Good. Are you bringing your shed up here you found? Yeah. So we can see it? I was just trying to get some more bushes while I was over here. So, our little spots. You know, we'll sit here and get it going. I'm just trying to get this fire going, but it's doing fairly good. I know, I saw it. There's Britt. Good job. <laughs> Yay! Yay, Blue! I'll see you soon. It is a freaking wide out. Rue's all cuddled up. Josh, there's our antler. And everything I own is wet and muddy. I'm trying to get my feet dry. This should be a survival video. <laughs> Survive the great outback. Except for we're not out back. We're in Nevada. On opening day. And no browns yet. Except for my uh, deer. Yeah, brown deer. <sighs> Alright, signing off. Quit snowing. We've left our fortress. And uh, we're about two miles from truck now. So that's what we're doing. It's cold. We're soaked. And uh, we found some sheds, so. Can't ask for anything more. It's about 6.30, 6.45 right now. Britt's getting her pack bolted back on. And uh, we'll be on our way. Huh, bro? And you found a shed all by yourself. All right, we made it back to the truck. It is 7.30. We changed because we were soaking wet and freezing our butts so off. Cool. And uh, now we're having some snacks. Got some sandwiches, some, some chips, and some drinks. And uh, we got Rue back here. A wet puppy, huh? She's just chilling in the back seat. And uh, I just got done making her her out of peanut butter sandwich. You're letting all my heat up. And, uh, <laughs> Some other tasty little snacks. So now let's walk over here and uh, see how we did uh -uh, for the day. We got our butts kicked, guys. Uh, Remy's horn was the highlight. That gagger and then Britt's uh, cool mildew set. Nice brown set. And uh, that thing, that thing is just big. I mean, he's he might not score a lot, but it's just, that is a, I mean, that's still, I'll bet that's a 370 bowl. And then uh, 
just a bunch of garbage. It was a fun trip. We had uh, a ball and we got to play around and do some things different. Made our little little uh, forts and got fires going and stayed warm. And I got to hunt, shed hunt with that hottie right there. So, all in all, I'd say it was a good trip, a good opener. We did find sheds, we didn't get skunked, and uh, we had fun. So, off to the next uh, the next location. I don't know. I'm I'm throwing up right now. I'm throwing up Colorado and Arizona. Um, I might do Arizona next time. Do Colorado this time. That way I can hit New Mexico. I don't know. We'll see. But let's get loaded up and go. It's coming down out there. Man. Sloppy. It's wet. What up? What up? I'm B. How about you? Uh, I am trying to regain my uh, original body temperature. <laughs> That's yeah. what I am. It was, uh, it was, it was cold. cold today. Our little forts and fires helped out a lot. Dude, I'm glad. Did you grab my raincoat? Or did yeah. I grab it? Well, I don't know. Whoever grabbed it, I'm so glad because I actually forgot my rain pants. I thought I forgot both of them. If I wouldn't have had that, I'd have been screwed today. Yeah. I would have been so wet and so cold. It would have been bad. First Light's rain gear is on point, for sure. I, I did not get one speck of wet where my raincoat was. How yeah, about you? Makes it nice. You had a rain. You have a raincoat too. Yeah. I had my pants. I just didn't bring them with me on the mountain. They're in the truck. Yeah, we weren't really thinking blizzard conditions. Were yeah. we? Like right now, I can't hardly see the goddamn room. <laughs> it's that bad. It's coming down that hard. And it is May of the 1st. The weather this year cannot make up its mind to save itself. Oh, that was a big puddle. <laughs> yeah, I gotta turn this one off. Okay. See. 